Okay, here's the thing. Alright. Well, alright, before. Alright, like, you know, before this, alright? Okay, well, can you pause all of this? Too, like, so much copyrighted material going on over here. I don't know. I don't even know if it's copyrighted or not. But anyway, see this here? This is the Shadow Hog. Um, Tactical X800 flashlight. It's really good. Now, I want to show you this. After we. I had to actually restart the vid because, um, like, someone decided to put copyrighted content in. Alright, right, I'm back here. Now, this here, it's really good. Now, this is the light itself. So, it's really durable light. So, I want to show you some of the modes. See, eh, well, you that's done mode. That's SOS, and that's like normal. But let me show you how bright this is. You will be amazed. Look, this is it, normal. Like I'm gonna put the camera right here so you can see. Like this is normal mode, and this is like zoom, like spotlight mode. So, it like anyone breaks in. You have a go-to light. So, see, it's pretty good. Now. Now, see, this is stun mode. Like, someone wakes in. You got this. Now, this mode is like if you broke down on the core. This is like SOS. That's the SOS, and this is normal. So, yeah. So, and this is handy, like, if you broke down on the road or something like that. And, uh, yeah. And, um, also, no, it's already on. And there. Now, see this here? This is the battery. And, um, let, let's, I'm gonna let it zoom, get that focus for you real quick. If it'll even focus correctly. See the 2650, it's a pad that's middle amp. So if you see the red batteries, like on eBay or Amazon, do not get them because they're 8,000 middle amps, or I don't even know. Or, 5,000 or whatever. They're not 5,000. 8, I meant. So, do not get them. I do not know what it'll do to the flashlight. I haven't got it yet. I'm not taking the chances. So, to let you know. And you got these. These here are like for these. I guess it's to keep it from like not moving. Or something like that. Now, see. Like, I bought some of these, some of these for like Christmas. Now... The thing is, it's always handy to have this around, just in case the power goes out and you cannot get to your charger, which I will go over in a minute. Now, what you want to do is, see this? You want to put this in like this. Make sure it goes in. Now, you want to put it in like that. And see, it's in like that. And then you want to get your little cap here and, you know, put it on. Like what you would do normally it's not that hard or anything actually it's not even hard now I see it's equally bright but he's saying I'm not gonna run it on this power for too long because I don't know how how you know long they'll last and it's always good to keep some of them around but like the one sleeves I was telling you about a minute ago. It comes with two of these. So see this charger here? I really do not recommend this charger. It's like a spring charger thing. And I recommend it. So that's, it's, it's like stock. So yeah. Um, all together, it's a good one. Like, I highly recommend it. <coughs> so... There's, like, no complaints about it. It's all bright. 
the um, ship. Uh, <clears throat> so guys, what I do recommend is um, y you see this here. This will save space, but gently put this underneath the spring, but do not damage your charger there. You kind of need it. You don't kind of, you definitely. Though, the, it's, it's pretty good. And the case you get, I think it's pretty sturdy too. I actually have three of these. One of them I got as a gift. Like two of them I got as a gift. No one ever knew that they would buy me it. So, uh, yeah, all together it's good. I recommend it. You should buy one. They're pretty cheap. So, thumbs up for this product. This is a review. You know, the part before this, it, it's not really in depth. I don't even know what that is. But, yeah, please like, subscribe more content. You're going to see the intro. No credit wall.